This is a product tutorial for Sense, a whole of government business intelligence tool that allows government officers to query their databases in natural language. In today's tutorial, we're going to be learning about primary keys and how to use them to merge different tables together. A primary key is a common data field or identifier across several different datasets, which can be used to merge different datasets together. As with the previous tutorial, we are looking at the COVID-19 case details dataset. However, we've also created a mock COVID-19 case weight distribution dataset that simulates the physical weight of each COVID-19 case individual. In this case, case underscore ID, which occurs across both tables, is a primary key. Thank goodness, the learning stops here. Sense automatically detects primary keys across all your datasets. In this case, when I ask Sense to calculate the average weight and group it by the gender of the individual, as well as whether the COVID-19 case was imported or local, Sense goes into action immediately. We see that Sense knows that it is supposed to join the case details table with the case weight table using the case underscore ID column. The result is a table that combines data from the weight distribution table with the case details table. And just like that, joining tables with primary keys is a very easy affair in Sense. In summary, we learned that primary keys refer to common data fields or identifiers across different datasets used for merging data. In Sense, we are able to identify the primary keys automatically, and Sense carries out the merging of different data tables automatically as well.